One great new feature in Adobe Premiere Pro is the ability to use media replacement in your motion graphic templates without needing to go back to After Effects to replace the clips. My name is Justin Odisho, and in this playlist, I'm going to show you how you can actually create your own motion graphic templates from scratch in After Effects and how you can export them out to Premiere Pro and use the new media replacement feature to create your own intros and slides. So what are motion graphic templates and how do you use them? If we're working inside of Adobe Premiere Pro, you can find them located in the Essential Graphics panel on the right-hand side, or if you're working in the Graphics workspace, you should find them in a more full panel. And motion graphic templates are preset templates with built-in graphics, text, or shapes that allow you to do things in an easy drag and drop way without needing to create them from scratch. For example, if I drag this call out title onto our sequence timeline, this will create this motion graphics clip and we can see a few things about it by highlighting it and opening the essential graphics panel and you can adjust each attribute about it. So I can change the text. I can change things about the color, the size and the font of the text and the position and about all of the shapes and the different shape colors. From this point, I can still adjust things about it like the position or the scale to make it make more sense for whatever we're trying to call out. If we want to get back to checking out some other ones that are available, we can click browse and we can do other things. So for example, another type of motion graphic template is these transitions. If I just drag this in between two clips, let's say I had another clip after this one, this one will serve as like a cool color blocking transition into the next shot. And just like with the other one, I can go in there and change things about the colors and the animation and the keyframes all by hand. Not only do you have all these built-in presets, but you can also create your own and load in others from scratch. For example, in this series, I'm going to show you how we can create this custom template and use some of the new media replacement tools to allow us to just change clips easily in a drag and drop fashion and make our own custom motion graphics intro template. In the first episode, we're gonna be learning how to actually create the template in After Effects. In the next episode, we're gonna learn how to animate and export the template. And then in the remaining episodes, we're gonna learn how to bring them into Premiere Pro, import your own clips with the new media replacement tools, and mix and match the templates to create your own intro sequences. We're also gonna include the project media files and motion graphic templates for you to work along with. So if you want to check out the first episode of this series, learn how we can get started creating our own motion graphic template, then head over here and click on the video to see the rest of the playlist on Adobe's channel. Thanks so much for watching.